Claims South Australia's school system is failing, with national test results revealing our children are lagging behind. And the Education Minister says he can't guarantee any improvements. A report card which leaves little to be proud of. South Australia's education system falling behind the rest of the country. What we've seen in South Australia uh, is a dramatic fail uh, when it comes to NAPLAN results. So we've, uh, many of our categories have gone backwards. This year's national literacy and numeracy test results are out and so too it seems are our students' marks. In almost all categories we fail to meet national standards. In Year 3, reading, writing and grammar were all down, the worst numeracy. Year 5's fared marginally better but are still lagging behind. The Year 7 results were the strongest with writing skills on par with other states. And Year 9 results were slightly up but still left us following the pack. The solution is very simple. If you want better literacy and numeracy outcomes, then you have to have smaller class sizes and better resources so that teachers can have the time to work with individual students. The opposition says the incoming Premier is failing to make the grade in his current job as Education Minister. Well, the numbers have been going down for quite some time here in South Australia and the government has refused to deal with it. But Mr Weatherall maintains the tests are just a snapshot. I mean, the NAPLAN test, as important as it is, is, does not measure everything about the, the strength of an education system. The Education Minister isn't disappointed with South Australia's NAPLAN results, instead highlighting the benefits of our middle-of-the-pack ranking. And despite introducing measures to improve our education system, he says he can't guarantee any improvements next year.